All right, welcome to this update uh, on uh, Ida. Uh, and uh, we have 10,780 people now without power on Long Island. Uh, the power outages are beginning to mount, and there is now a large one on the South Shore as well. This one's pretty large, actually, 1,147. Uh, and again, you're starting to see that flooding now. Uh, we still have not too many. Uh, we have some outages in the middle of the island. We still have the outages that are on this, the North Shore. Uh, uh, but we have more outages now occurring in Suffolk County. Uh, let's get to that right now. And again, uh, there's so much going on right now. Suffolk County now starting to see some more outages. Let's see what we got out here. Outage in Wading River. Um, so the power is going out, and we're going to have more winds. Well, we're not done yet with the wind. Yes, yeah, so, uh, we got the Eaton's Neck outage there. That's still ongoing. Um, South Shore uh, starting to see uh, oh yeah we're starting to see some power outages on the South Shore there's a large one now in Lindenhurst as well uh, and that's just because uh, the water is, the, the the ground is saturated and any little bit of wind knock down a tree or even a power pole uh, the ground is just too soft uh, and things are just collapsing right now and that's that's why you're seeing what you're seeing with all these these power outages occurring and uh, we still have all the outages that I showed you before in the other update on the North Shore but now you have some outages on the South Shore too. JCPNL 40,000 people without power right now 40,529 um, Ocean County starting to see some additional outages here. More outages in Middlesex County uh, as we uh, watch. And then uh, also outages now. Uh, plenty of outages on the north. That's where most of the outages are as well. Uh, let's go to the Power Outage U.S. map. Let's just use this already because it's just you, you can see New Jersey. 90,000 people now. In the state of New Jersey, no power. Uh, Sussex really getting hit hard. Uh, Essex, Bergen County as well, 8,000 there. Essex, 15,000. Uh, Middlesex, 6,787. Somerset, 10,000. Hunterdon, uh, 5,000. Uh, Warren. Uh, and Ocean County now 1,536, and Monmouth over 2,000. Let's go look at New York because we're seeing the outages now at Mountain New York here. It's not, it's not even loading at this point. Well, let's see. We have outages mounting. Westchester, 8,000. Uh, Queens, we have 200. Brooklyn, 599. Staten Island pushing 2,000. Uh, Westchester, uh, let's see. Uh, we got uh, Putnam, at two, over 2,000. Orange. So the power outages are beginning to mount. We're starting to see them now in Connecticut, too, as well. Uh, we have 15,000 people without power in Connecticut now as well. Uh, so, uh, yeah, this storm, Ida, continuing to cause havoc. It's amazing that it actually managed to strengthen once it got toward the east coast. And that's because it got a little extra. It became extra tropical, but it also got some energy uh, from the ocean, too, I believe. Uh, let's take a look at the latest weather observations across the area. And I still left this up from before. But let's go to the latest observations here. And uh, we'll talk about the rain but i want to go over these observations temperatures are dropping cold fronts is through winds have shifted to the north but now we're seeing wind gusts from the north up to 30 miles an hour 32 mile an hour wind gusts at laguardia so we're starting to see those winds from the north out east we still have uh we still have uh these uh these high 40 mile an hour wind gusts at shirley right now um and there are there was there are some tornado warnings actually being issued. Tornado warning on Cape Cod, I believe. There's a cell over here that's produced a tornado warning as well. Uh, so uh, we've got lots of stuff going on. You can see these strong wind gusts, 20 miles an hour, uh, and uh, quite a uh, quite impressive, quite impressive. In fact, let's put the pressure on here. I wish it wouldn't show it in millibars, uh, but that is quite low. That is quite low. So the air pressure is quite low as well. Um, just incredible, incredible, uh, incredible situation going on right now across the area. There, a flash flood emergency in New York State. Uh, we have lots and lots and lots of flooding going on all across the area. We're actually pretty lucky in Mineola that we didn't get any of this so far, at least not that I'm aware of, not at least where I'm at. Uh, but uh, there's flooding, uh, buildings are flooding, uh, subways flooded. Uh, uh, transit is a mess. NJ Transit is probably still suspended at this point. Uh, let's see. NJ tra All NJ Transit service, rail service, and buses could also be uh, affected, too, by these flooded roadways as well. Uh, so uh, we don't even know what's going on with that right now. 
Uh, the railroad, let's go to the Twitter here. Let's go to the Twitter. Let's find that. Uh, let's see what we have right now. Uh, yes, they have suspended system-wide now. So uh, this is because of the flooding uh, going on right now. Uh, people, are, are, people are mad, but what do you want them to do? The tracks are flooded. Uh, and uh, until, the, until the rain stops, they cannot, it's not safe at this time to run service. Uh, severe weather conditions along the Port Washington branch. Uh, down trees on the tracks near Cold Spring Harbor. Uh, severe weather conditions on the Oyster Bay branch. Uh, and uh, again, they suspended between Penn Station and Jamaica. But now it is, it is completely suspended at this point uh, because of just the conditions are just so bad outside right now. Everything is flooded. Uh, there's lots and lots and lots of flooding. This rain is continuing. Let's look at the radar right now. It's still raining. There is an end in sight. So I'm hopeful that we'll have some service back by the morning. But right now, until this water recedes and the rain has to stop for that to happen. And you can see, look at this heavy thunderstorms right now over central Suffolk County now on this radar. Uh, let's uh, go look at that. And see, there may actually be a lot of lightning with these, too. Let's see what we got here. Oh, yeah, quite a bit of lightning going on with these in Suffolk County, by the way. Uh, so these storms are knocking out power. Um, NJ Transit, Long Island Railroad. I don't know about Nice Bus at this point, but I would imagine that uh, Nice Bus may have decided to temporarily suspend service also because of the uh, situation. Let's see if they have any alerts right now. Um, nothing, nothing going on right now uh, as far as alerts go, but I would imagine that buses, whatever bus service is running is subject to detour. Uh, MTA info, I mean, pretty much everything is shut down at this point. The subways are suspended. Uh, rail service is suspended now system-wide uh, because of flooding, and bus service might already be. Uh, they just have find and track buses, but I would imagine that's subject to suspension too because I saw in the news that the buses were stuck in floodwaters. So incredible amounts of rain going on across the area. Uh, and again, we have these strong winds going on. Let's go and look now at the, uh, the, uh, the amount of rain that has fallen right now. We're going to go to the precipitation. And we're going to roll this back to, uh, let's roll this back to, uh, uh, yeah, we already have it. All right, so we already have it 9-1. All right, but now i got to move this to 9-2 because it's, not, it's, it's the current. In fact, this might be a problem. Let's, let's try to refresh this here. Let's try this again. You know, we're having a lot of traffic on the websites right now, and that is causing a lot of problems. Uh, and uh, we're trying to get information, but it's not easy. Uh, and again, you can see flash. If you're thunderstorm warning in Suffolk County, flash. Basically, every type of warning was still under that tornado watch. Um, let's go. Surface observations, historical, precipitation, and uh, let's start this at. Um, again, we'll start this at 11 a.m. here, so you see what's going on here. Let's see how much rain has fallen because it's absolutely incredible here. Let me just get these layers down a little bit here so you can see these layers. Uh, and uh, just incredible amounts of rain over parts of Nassau County. Uh, let's get some of these observations on the screen here for you. Drum roll, please. I know it's being slow. 3.18 in Levittown. Farmingdale, 1.34. 3.22 inches in Hempstead. 3.99 in Great Neck. I mean, the ground is saturated. Uh, you know, we're having another three. We're having a month's worth of rain in, in one night. Um, uh, 4.29 at JFK, uh, 6.82, Central Park has had 6.82 inches of rain, um, 6.42 at LaGuardia, uh, look at some of these uh, numbers in New Jersey right now, um, 8.26 at Harrison, 5.92 at Gabbert Mountain Pass, 6.48 uh, you're six, seven, eight, nine inches of rain, uh, and there there are major flooding in a lot of areas in New Jersey right now. Whole towns have turned into rivers, streets. It's 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 absolutely insane. Seven point three three at Greenbrook. So far further south in Jersey, it's not not as bad. Tom's River again getting off easy. For once they got off easy. I mean they always get pounded. They deserve a break, all right? Uh, but the central part of New Jersey, Keyport, four point eight nine. I mean, these are incredible rainfall totals. Eight point seven eight in Staten Island. I mean, this is just flooding. Everything is just flooding. The ground can't hold it all. And until the rain stops, uh, there's gonna be everything's gonna be flooded. Uh, let's look at some of these roads here, uh, shall we? Let's see how the, some of these roads look, uh, because I know we have some flooding issues. Let's see what we got here. 
And I don't know if this updated the issues here. Let's see if this updated the flooding issues because there's a lot of flooding all over the place. Uh, let's see what we got over here. Here, um, Looks like that might be flooded. Um, a lot of roads are flooded right now. Uh, let's see what we got here. Flooding on Grand Central Parkway eastbound. So, yeah, that's closed off. That's not moving. Uh, uh, and, and we got the flooding here on Long Island. I mean, flooding all over the place. Looks like we have a closure on the northern state. Flooding, northern state closed. Flooding in, in uh, uh, Hicksville right now, or Jericho, I should say, our northern state. Um, so, uh, actually, no, it's not Hicksville. It's North Hills. My mistake. I am sorry. So much going on. We got flooding on the expressway, too, over here. Let's see what it looks like here. Looks like it is moving. Um, I was trying to cover all the flooding power outage reports. We got flooding here in Westbury on the Northern State Parkway here. Uh, flooding in Westbury. Um, South Shore, let's see any flooding there. I don't see any flooding reports on the South Shore yet. But there could be some more. We have another flooding report. Looks like Sagatos flooding a Crooked Hill Road. Let's see if we can get a look at that. Oh, yeah. I see the water. There it is. So uh, flooding at Crooked Hill. Let's see. Oh, there it is. There it is right there. They already have the arrow there. Some flooding there. Uh, incredible uh, and just incredible stuff that we're seeing right now this is a historic rainfall event and look at all these over the city if you think we got hard the city in New Jersey got really just pounded let's see what we got going on here cars stuck there's cars stuck in flood water right there right over here we have a flood a flood on the Grand Central uh, where is this the B 278 and the Grand Central we have a flood here as well uh, video not available on that camera. Let's see. We got this one here. Uh, here you go. Uh, cars. People trying to drive through it. It's not a good idea. People should not be trying to drive through any of these floodwaters. Uh, just go around. Find another way around it. Uh, you shouldn't even be traveling now. Uh, we have another closure here. Flooding on the FDR as well. Uh, flooding there as well. Uh, so we have flooding all over the place. What do we have here? Weather-related south tube. Okay, so we don't know if these tunnels have flooded. We know that the subways have flooded. We know that. We've got flooding in Dumbo, too. Flooding on two, uh, 278. Uh, let's see if we can see anything from here. Uh, yeah, I see police cars, so that probably means it's closed off. I mean, you have lots and lots of people stuck right now. It's a, it's, it's a major, major disaster occurring all across the area. And New Jersey, I mean, I can't even keep track of all these roads that are flooded. Let's see. We've got, a f we've got flooding on the New Jersey Turnpike. Uh, let's see. Nothing available, of course, because I, I'm not even going to look at New Jersey's cameras. But it, it's incredible. Let's go to the power outage because it's probably jumped again. 10,000 still. Uh... Let me go back to Twitter here, and let's see what's going on here with Twitter. And I have, yes, I have a video of, the, of what it was like, that heavy rain. I, I never seen it rain like that ever. Uh, let's see. We're just going to put NYC in here and see what happens. Uh, Bill de Blasio, the mayor, has declared a safe state of emergency. Here you go. Flooding. Uh, climate change is here. NYC is underwater. Look at that. It's here. This is the climate emergency I've been talking about. Look at this. That is a wedge. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my God. Look at that. Where is that? Is that that? Oh my, look at that. Oh, what are we, in the Midwest? Look at that. There's a tornado right there. Oh, my God. That's insane. I don't know. If that's, that's on the turnpike somewhere, it looks like. Costco. Look at this. Costco. NYC. Rain. This is uh, high school, heart of Flatbush, flooding, climate crisis. A lot of people have been talking about it. This is what I've been talking about. And this is 145th on the one line. Look at that. Nowhere is immune to climate change. Look at this. Bathroom, flooding. A catastrophic situation in New York City after flooding. This is 28th Street. Look at this. Look at that. The subway is going to be out of order for a while. Multiple homes flooded in New York City. This one is in Brooklyn. 
currently trapped in a subway station because all trains have been halted. Uh, and uh, flooded and on fire. Uh, this is uh, short on the third rail here. Uh, coming into contact with the water, I guess, and arcing. Uh, that, is, that is insane right there. Uh, NYC flooding. This is horrible. People have their homes damaged. This is going to be a million, millions of dollars, this disaster. Billions of d dollars. Uh, uh, unbelievable. From Lola, yeah, we are uh, we are going through what New Orleans. New York City is going through what New Orleans went through after Katrina. Look at this. Look at this. This is, this, is, this damage is just New York's infrastructure is completely unprepared. Terminal 8. BQE totally submerged. Flooding all over New York City. Subway. This is a disaster. Major disaster. Major disaster uh, right now. And, and then there's New Jersey. Then there's New Jersey. Uh, Milburn. One of the towns. I think we can maybe get uh, flash flooding in Milburn here. Flooding in Milburn. Look at this video here of Milburn, New Jersey. This is Milburn, New Jersey, folks. Look at all the water. God, we were real lucky on, on Long Island. It could have been so much worse. Murphy has declared a state of emergency. People's homes are being flooded. So this is an example of what's going on. And this video is all over. A uh, video is off. Flash flooding in Lambertville, New Jersey. Uh, this is this is unbelievable. This is just unbelievable. Let's just show you some more images here, New Jersey. Let's see what we can get here. Uh, here's some here's North Plainfield cars underwater. Uh, this is incredible. I have never seen anything like this before, and this is why I felt that sense of dread because I knew it was gonna be bad. Um, and. Uh, this is what we're dealing with with, with, with the climate emergency. Uh, this is what I've been talking about for so long, uh, and that we got to do something immediately. Immediately. This, forget about the damn pandemic already. We've got something way bigger, and that is this climate crisis uh, right now. All right? I have to say it, because this is a much bigger threat that we need to address. The pandemic needs to be way in the back. All right? If you've been vaccinated, you're going to be fine. And if you don't want to get vaccinated, you die. All right? But for people, who look, who, how are you going to stop all this? All right? How are you going to stop all this? This is going to be a lot harder to stop. And, that, and that's what it makes. Look at this. Seven, eight inches of rain in New York City and New Jersey. This is, this is crazy. This is not normal at all. This is, this is crazy. I, I've never seen anything like this. This is absolutely insane. I was going to go to something else, and I forgot what it was. If it was the we uh, something, uh, well, we have the wonder map here. This is the, oh, it's frozen. Let me close that up. So everything is suspended right now, obviously due to all the flooding and the water on the tracks. And it's going to take quite some time uh, to, you know, get the service back. Uh, if I go to my LAWR, I'm pretty sure it would just say suspended. Uh, let's just see what happens here. I'm pretty sure it would say, yeah, it's due to flash flooding. Uh, so there's flash flooding on the tracks everywhere right now. Uh, and uh, you can see all these closures right now going on. Let's see what it looks like in Mineola right now here. Uh, it looks like I said, uh, Mineola fared okay. You'll see the video. We had some flooding, but nothing like nothing like these other areas. Uh, we've been very, very fortunate here uh, so far. But we're going to still deal with this wind. Uh, and uh, like I said, I think we're out of the woods with the storms right now. They're moving away, and they're moving into Suffolk County. So the rain will start to taper off for Nassau County, the city of New Jersey. Suffolk County, you're going to be dealing with it for a few more hours hours uh, and you can see these uh, really strong uh, thunderstorms here uh, that are ongoing here uh, absolutely incredible natural disaster that we are witnessing tonight uh, it does feel like I'm leaving something out let's maybe I'm leaving out showing the satellite I don't know it just feels like I'm leaving something out so let's uh, let's go look at the satellite image maybe I'm uh, you can see there it is there's the storm right there incredible all oh, the rivers and lakes that's right i wanted to go to the rivers and lakes all right so let's do that you can see all these colors on here tornado watch i think is over i think it is expired it's after one o'clock but we still have flash flood warnings in effect 
and they will be till at least 6.30 in the morning. So uh, three to six inches of rain. This is insane, the amount of rain we've had. Uh, let's go to the rivers and lakes and see uh, if we can get any flood gauge reports here uh, because I'm sure that they are up. Th oh, yeah, they're all in major flooding already. Uh, look at this. So uh, uh, we have uh, Bronx River at Botanical Gardens, major flooding. These are all in major flooding right now. Let's see, I'm going to get this here to show you let me move this over here uh and peconic river too minor flooding on the peconic river you'll see that there and maybe in the right hand corner it's showing up major flooding in all these rivers here bound brook uh all these rivers major flooding moderate flooding major flooding rawway river um Third River at Bloomfield, you know, I don't know if you're seeing this. Let me pull this out a little bit so you can see this because I know I have this a little cropped in here. So let's see if you can see that. Hopefully you can see some of these hydrographs here. Uh, and uh, and the Tom's River also now. All right, Barnegat Bay up there. Let's see Tom's River. Not flooding yet, but it might. Uh, we have a flood at this, at this gauge right here, Barnegat Bay. That's in the moderate flood stage. So red is moderate, purple is major. Uh, and uh, these rivers here, Saddle River, uh, continuing to rise at Lodi. Uh, Bronx River up there. I think we already did the Bronx River. Let's say Passaic River. Uh, all these rivers are in flood stage right now. Uh, I have never seen it light up like this before. Uh, this is absolutely incredible. Uh, and Housatonic also going to probably go to make it to major flood stage two as well. Uh, so we have lots and lots. This is the Carl's River at Babylon, which isn't doing much. Uh, but uh, these rivers here in Jersey are really going nuts here. Uh, this is an unbelievable disaster. I can't believe the New York City stations actually aren't all up all night. They should be going all night covering this disaster that is taking place in our in our area right now. So uh, I'm going to wrap this video up right now, and we'll keep you posted on what's going to be happening here. We have 69 gauges in flood as this disaster uh, starts to wrap up. We start getting rid the rain will start ending, uh, but the damage will take uh, days, weeks, and months to recover from.